Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of The Streak. We are jumping in again and this time we got Chaboy Samson. Not particularly a difficult character, but you never know. You never know. Uh, let's jump on in. 53 wins in the bag. 53 wins in the bag and many, many more to come. Hopefully. Hopefully. And our destination, we got Mother this time, so we'll try and do Mother. Mother's not always a guarantee, obviously. We really have to sort of assess the run and see if Mother is viable. I don't want to just go straight into Mother if it's going to be a pretty much guaranteed death. But, but Mother is the destination of choice at the moment, so we'll try our best to take a little look at going over to Mother. A bomb off the bat's really nice. Secret room potentially is to our left here. Mm, I'm actually thinking more than potentially. I think it definitely is to our left. I'm going to take out you first because you're going to get annoying otherwise. Also, to be fair, you are really annoying producing a buttload of spiders. He's going to get quite a few out before I manage to kill him, isn't he? Luckily, this thing doesn't have a lot of health. Okay, I'm pretty sure secret room's right there, but I've only got one bomb thus far. I don't know why I didn't go into my item room first here. That was my mistake. Um, I'm going to leave this guy to kind of do his thing and destroy a bunch of stuff for us because we could get a crawl space out of this or more. I mean, he'll eventually kill himself on this bomb rock over here. But I'm going to leave this guy to, to do his thing. And he'll eventually give us a crawl space, won't you? There you go. <laughs> it's just that simple. Unfortunately, I might be able to get into... Get, I'm trying to get into get the pot, but it's a little difficult. You can't really make him change directions, so we might be waiting here a while if we want to just wait for him. I'll give him one more chance. There you go. Beautiful. This fella. Intriguing here. We got a crawl space um, thingy here. Always a little risky here, but this potentially is quite good. Um... Oh, what the fuck, game. <laughs> <laughs> That's not what I meant to do at all. Not what I meant to do at all. There you go. Um, see, there's some good stuff here. Like these two in particular are very good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna sort of see what we get for the rest of our floor. I mean, we've got some bombs already here, so we can check out secret room. Um, <clears throat> let's see if it is here, because I'm pretty sure it is. Yeah, there you go. Um, nothing super special going on in here. Ooh. Um, locked doors can be entered for free. Chance to spawn an extra room clear reward in blue rooms. I'm gonna take that. That's pretty good. Free entry to rooms is good. I don't know if it'll occur on rooms that don't need keys, though. Okay, it won't. We also got the straw here. I actually think the straw is pretty good. Um, it's pretty decent. Alright, let's keep moving. Yeah, 10% damage to every enemy in the room. 10% of our damage. As our damage increases, that'll get better and better. Did you see that dodge right there? Did you see that dodge? Some professional shit right there. Also, a chance to get a half heart from uh, from these fellas as well is kind of nice. We got algae's for the room. Good, good. We also got a holy mantle out of that as well. I didn't even notice that. Um... I mean, I'll definitely bomb you. Kind of want to get in there, but don't want to waste my, my stuff here. Ooh, this is potentially good. There's a half heart there. <clears throat> I don't know if there's any way to get to these. Do we have any anything that can give us flight here? No card for sale. But not on that front. Hmm... Nine volt, I think, is probably really good with straw. I think I'm going to go nine volt. I'm, I'm pretty sure this works with straw. If it doesn't, I'm going to be a little bit annoyed. Uh, bomb beggars don't really do anything for us here. <clears throat> Okay, a little bit risky to take uh, a, a trade so early, but I think it's worthwhile. Yeah, I'm hoping basically what will happen now is our straw will start off half-charged. Yes, it will. That's very, very good. This makes the straw 
way, 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 way better. Ten percent of our damage to a to a boss is is pretty significant. This often, and being able to get red hearts out of it too, it's 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 all good, man. It's all good. I'm very very happy with this. I think this this the straw is a really really good active to have. That's a very stupid thing for me to do there. Really really good active to, for us to have with nine volt here. As for the question of the day today, what's something you've regretted this week? What what's a regret you've had this week? Uh, so I, I think we are actually pretty raring to go for a um for a downpour. I forgot we don't need to use our keys. Completely forgot about that. Right, these guys fire some herming shenanigans. <clears throat> I don't know if it hits enemies off screen is one thing. Crack that open. Good stuff. Um I'm confused. Where's the where's the door? Okay, <laughs> that was that was slightly strange. But yeah, not needing keys for the rest of the run's really nice. Having it gold to get the extra room rewards is good. Boiler does scare me a little bit, but having a soul heart to back us up makes me feel a little bit better about it. Also, to be fair, one, one really good thing about this run right now is we can effectively just sit back and chill and not interact with anything and just let the straw kill stuff passively. As our damage increases, that becomes more and more of an option as well, so... Pretty good. Pretty good. I'm excited to have straw. I will bomb these. Seems like a good opportunity. We got a key penny there as well. Okay, good. <clears throat> cool. I'm into this. This is interesting. This is a, a rather peculiar run that I'm, I'm, yeah, really down with right now. Just being able to kill the small enemies near instantly. And like I said, once our damage gets to good levels, it's going to be crazy how effective the straw is. Even rooms like this become... I won't say trivialized, but a lot easier. I can't believe I took a full soul heart of damage on, on that guy. Was it this guy that hit me? The, the bigger one? Must have been. Good, good. Then in here, very, very good. We'll take that. Aquarius would have also been decent, but the guarantee of, uh, of these flies is nice. Dude, taking some rough damage here. Luckily, the straw will heal us. Okay. Allows you to use your active without having enough charge. Ooh. I'm kind of intrigued as to how that works with this. I kind of don't think it will, but I think it's a good item to have regardless. I'm intrigued. I'm certainly intrigued. Can I just go like this? <laughs> I can. It's a little risky, but I can do it. <laughs> And I slowly get my stats back. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> I absolutely love that. Obviously, it's not very good for, like, bosses and stuff. But, I don't know. That's pretty cool. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Okay, take care of you. Justice is pretty nice to have here. Okay, still a little wary about my HP. Uh, secret room definitely is something we want to find here. Um, I mean, seems pretty obvious that it's here. We can take spicy keys. We gain some damage for doing that, obviously quite nice. And then we also gain our health back right here. Okay. Back to the boss we go. So I've got plenty of money to work with, but I don't think there's anything else in a shop we wanted, is there? There's the coin flip thingy. I'll take a sack. Wow, that was the most worthless. <laughs> it just cost us five cent for nothing. 
this is a boss that I'm still really unfamiliar with. Yeah, so I was going to say, expect me to get hit. But he is now dead. Health, please. Kind of hoping for health or damage. There you go, baby. Okay, to the next floor. I am really into this run right now. This run is really goddamn cool. <laughs> I would like some speed ups to, to negate the speed downs that I get. But the way that it charges, basically I can do that every room. <laughs> That's awesome. I love that. Yeah, and then after the room, my stats go back to normal and the straw just starts recharging. Obviously, I have to then wait between rooms for to get the straw back. Oh, for God's sake! Not be not able, able to keep my devil deals at all at the moment, which is a bit annoying. George is very, very good. We'll take that. We'll also bomb this. We'll come back for you, Soulheart. We'll come back for you. Okay. Wild times, this is... Yeah, the speed down is bad. We definitely need some speed ups. I also need to fucking get a devil deal going at some point so I can get an angel deal eventually, but... God knows if that's ever gonna happen. The minute it doesn't look likely because I'm getting hit a ton and I keep losing my goddamn soul hearts. At least we're getting a red hearts here, there, and everywhere. Yeah, let's, let's wait until we've chomped this guy down a little bit first. <clears throat> Once we've got him into some lesser forms, we can uh, start wailing on him with the uh, the old straw tactic. I get four uses of straw every room. I guess I can get more uses by not doing the spam tactic. But like on small rooms, it's better to get all of the uses out the way straight away, I think. We got shoop de whoop. Unfortunately, I, I I don't know. This is tricky because shoop the whoop with nine volt is very, very good. Shoop the whoop with nine volt means we get to use it every single room. But I just, I really like this straw tactic we've got going on. It's very fun. Right. Um, I, I really like Paris's rags. It can be dangerous. It can reroll items randomly sometimes based on some books. But for the most part, it's pretty good. We got our ultra secret room and we got something pretty goddamn good. Worm friend is decent. Right, bomb this guy for the soul heart. Ah, I didn't even get the money for the soul heart. Damn you game. Okay, we do want to go through there. Let's go fight our boss first. See what boss we've got. I'll go by uh, go by the soul heart now as well, actually. Yeah, I'm gonna say shoot the whip is definitely better, but I think straw right now is more fun. Okay. I can't buy that, I don't have the money for it. You doofus. Uh, do we know where secret room is then? Probably just to our right here. Yeah, it's almost definitely here. Um, okay. Does that really do anything for us? Not much. Okay. Back we go. Um... We've got a lot of red health about here. I think what I'm going to do is come back in here. Go one, two, three, four. That gives us a bunch of damage. Then we can come and check our boss trap room to see if it's uh, safe. It's not. It's not actually worth it, I don't think. Um... Come grab a bit more HP around. 
We take a few more hits to see if we can get some more damage. Okay, we're at full now. Take that. Good, because now we're dealing tons more damage with our straw. That's kind of the main reason I did that. Same with our flies. Our flies are dealing a ton more damage as well. This is another reason why the straw is so very good for us right now. Um, why did you just jump on my head, sir? Now, I don't know how this works with the segments. This might be dealing 10% damage to every segment, which is kind of crazy. Oh, I got stuck. How did that not kill the leeches? There's the speed we're looking for. That's good, that's good. We've got two bombs to get through here as well. We'll toss those down now so we don't forget. Do we want to come and do the boss again is the question. Do we want to come and do the boss again? Right. Mirror room. In we go. Good, good. One second. Okay, we be back. We be back. I can't remember what we're doing. It's been a little, a little minute. Oh, we get red rooms in here as well. I wasn't expecting this. Probably shouldn't have gone for this, to be honest. This enemy's an absolute nightmare. Okay, all good. All good. Full card. Do you know what? I'm going to go do the boss now that I have a full card. Because now that I have a full card, I can back out if I lose my holy mantle. So why not go and try the boss? Why not try it? Also, Worm Friend's super, super useful for this. It's all these extra bombs and keys and stuff that we're getting that's super useful as well. Really, really nice. Right, so just full card if things go wrong. Wow. Well, that went very right, and we got a soul heart of it. This was... Oh, and we got more speed as well. Awesome. Okay. This was stupendously good. Uh, what happens? Can we fight the mini-boss again? I don't know if we can. We can. Okay, nice. Holy shit. Yeah, the, the, the speed down isn't anywhere near as bad anymore. Uh, okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. This has all been very good. Uh, I ought to go into the shop as well to get another red room. Just see if I get anything special. Another sack. That was special. We like it. Okay. This has been fucking amazing. <laughs> Very glad I came here. Right. Let's get the hell out of here. We are out of the mirror. We'll also bomb the mirror now that we're out of it. For the extra reflected item chance. Because why not? I'm also going to check the shop again. Because I swear there was another item in there. We are going to lose a lot of damage going down to the next floor here. So that is going to be a bit of a shame. Oh, no, it was a soul heart we wanted, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, we are going to lose a lot of damage going down to the next floor, but I think we're okay. I'm really glad that we got all this speed. Jupiter. Yeah, unfortunately, the Papyrus rags every three rooms using a book, it can be really detrimental because there's a few books that, like, remove items and stuff. So we can end up kind of bricking our run a little bit by accident. But yeah, you can see we are much weaker now. I'm actually a little bit worried about doing Mother, considering our damage is so low as of base. Um, oh, that should open another cash room, I see. Oh, Lord. Empty hearts, kind of interesting. Empty hearts, kind of interesting. Oops, something wicked got an error there. 
Wooden dice? I've not got wooden dice. Am I telling me about wooden dice? Weird. Take care of you boys. Extra room reward, lovely. 120 volt? Do we care for 120 volt? I'm gonna take random. Tiny horn. I don't think I've had tiny horn before. Okay. He's a, a charge shot and fires a little uh That's pretty cool. I like him. Oh dude! <laughs> Getting fucking slapped right now. Boom. Makes life easier. What's, what's, what's going on in this room? Okay, nothing. <laughs> I was like, waiting for something to happen. Nothing's gonna happen. We got going on in here. See, look at that. Beautiful. Water bottle is very, very good. We'll try and uh, try and grab that at some point. One of you dead. God damn, we are slapping right now. Yeah, water bottle's very, very good. We'll try and grab that. A lot of enemies are just dying instantly to. Uh, to the straw. To the whim of the straw. I don't like you. Get out of here. Hearts will drop more often. We'll definitely take that for the next floor. Crack that open. Okay. Still need that extra penny from somewhere. Probably from the mob trap room, if I was to think. Need a way to reduce my red hearts as well. There's that penny. That was a good throw, my good sir. That was a good throw. Get careful of the bombs. Oh, God damn it! I'm getting hit by some really stupid stuff right now. Really stupid stuff. I'm going to go back and check out this room. I do kind of want to go into the uh, cash rooms here, but I've just not got the HP for it. Good, good. Take out Tinted Rock. Lovely. Oh, mini boss. Wasn't expecting that. Unfortunately, didn't get lard. Actually, to be fair, would I have even taken lard? I don't think I would. Don't think I even would. Right. Speed back to the shop and buy... I don't even remember what it was now. There was something in there I wanted. I remember that. Uh, what was it? Oh, it was water spout. Yeah, the water bottle's really, really good. Lots of extra fire it. Very, very weird shop item. Should not be in the shop, in my opinion. I got Minecrafter for some reason here. I try and grab these whenever I can. It's not imperative, but it does help. Some really good stuff here. Lots of tears. Still no damage. Still no damage. Um, this is tricky. Hitbox size is reduced. Grants extra damage for the current room for narrowly avoiding projectile caps at three. Chance to fire a tier that has extra damage and aggressive herming. Yeah, we'll go with that. We'll go with that. Trisagian's good, but I think that's better. I think we're good to go, although we should probably look for secret room. Where do you think we look in? 
Definitely down this way somewhere. Might be directly down from here. Or probably more than likely right here. Um... Lots of good HP. I think that is probably better than the key at this point. We've, we've got plenty of keys to work with. Okay. That was a pretty good payout from that. Pretty good payout. Health is looking very, 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 very good. So jumping down to the next floor. Jack of hearts. Make sure to pop that immediately on the next floor. Yeah, I really, really just want to up my damage to make our straw better, and we're just getting no damage whatsoever. Absolutely no damage. Like, it's, it's kind of wild that we've got all these items and none of them have been a damager. Don't revive, you dick. You're not allowed to do that. Oh, you're still alive? Okay. Right, crawl space. Can you be our hero, baby? Damn! If we'd have fucking kept that electricity thing from last time, that'd have been amazing. Still, though, we can play this for extra damage. Good, good, good. Playing that for extra damage is very nice. If only we could have one of those on every floor. It would be beautiful. Half soul heart there as well. Yeah, look look how much better that is with the straw. God damn. So much better. Okay, there's no enemies in here. Slightly annoying room, but just beeline it through it. Okay, that was really good, that. You see that? My worm friend grabbed onto him. Demolished. Still no damage! Diggity hot damn game. This is brutal. Really should have taken the latch key after that, but hey her. God damn, this has been really frustrating for damage. I'm kind of worried about Mother. Basically, on the last floor, I have to take enough damage to up my DPS. Otherwise, I'm going to have a really hard time. Wait, is another red heart in here I missed? Yes. Right, item room. Please just give us, like, Ipecac or some shit. <laughs> just a few pennies there. Hello. We're gonna get some buku books from this bad boy. This will be quite the chunk of change for us. We got the shovel. The shovel is good, but we already have a crawl space this floor, unfortunately, and straw is too much of my DPS to get rid of. Hopefully we can re-roll it at some point. Don't be messing me around. Right. In here, Greed's butt's just very, very, very good. Get your bombs away from me, big sir. Item room. Please. Please be our hero. It's the poop! <laughs> Yay! Our hero. The poop.
Damage up! Oh my god, damage up! You'll never believe it. Probably don't want to play that right now. Right. Away we go. Once again. This has been rough. This has been rough. Um, don't think there's much else I want to play in machines and stuff. I guess I could take IV bag, but I'd much rather have what I have now. Um, knife piece two. There we go. Got our knife piece. I don't like doing the chase thing. It's hella laggy on there uh, on modded. You all know that. Some of you may be new, but most of you know that. Get our flies on him. We've got 4.75 damage as base now, which is certainly much, much more respectable. Still not great. Okay, I think if I'm going to do my... my Space bar tech, I need to spam the hell out of it, otherwise I don't get as many uses. Yeah, let's not let's not be reviving everything, please. These books got a lot of HP. Wow, our items have been so trash. Rubber cement's pretty good. Pretty decent. But our item room items have been so trash. Right. Land, you bird. You stinking bird. Hello. That's an error room right there. Don't go through the error room. I might go through the error room later, but not now. Small rock. Damn you. Damn you, game. Some sort of book friend start this room that's spewing out some sort of weird demon spiders. I'll take them. It'll be a fine addition to our collection of weird stuff. Shop time. Oh, really? This is another error room. Got a lot of error rooms here. A lot of error rooms. I think we can take the error rooms. I think it will take us to the correct next floor. Look how much damage that did. Fire it. Good, but still not damage. Please. Please, something that gives us damage. It's damage! Sanguine Bond is also not bad. We could get quite a lot of damage off of the back of Sanguine Bond. We could also get a whole lot of nothing. I'm going to take it and take a few pulls at it. There's some damage. Two. There's some more damage. Three. Yes. We got three lots of damage out of that. Okay. Very happy with that. Very, very happy with that. And also play this a little bit now as well. We didn't go to Secret Room earlier, did we? It's always whited out on the map, so it looks like we've been to it before, but I'm pretty sure we haven't. What does this one do? Grants an aura that slows enemies and reflects pro uh, projectiles for a hundred seconds. Okay, I'll be holding on to that, thank you. Right, error room. 
please yield us something amazing. Oh, why didn't I buy the goddamn... Hello? Are you a boss or what's going on here? No, you're not. That's a lot of soul hearts. Can you fuck off and stop distracting me, please? Okay. This was a very, very good path to go down. And we're going. This should take us to the correct floor. Yes, it did. Good, 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 good. Okay, our base damage is now literally double what it was before. It's still not great for the floor we're on, but it is a much, much better. I'd like you to, to fucking die, please. Furton, we'll take Furton, that's extra damage as well. And with, uh, with, with Rubber Cement, it's pretty good, actually. Well, the cement Furton's pretty good. I like Furton as a knight, anyways. It's pretty cool. It's just unique. Right. Try and get gone here. You two are getting blasted. Absolutely blasted. Yeah, I like this now. We got we got some really good damage going on. Ha, who'd have thought the straw would be the, the absolute G of this run? I don't know what that is, but I'm going to buy it. Ah, it's just coupon. Goddamn coupon. You want to fuck off, man? Gotta remember we've got greed butt as well. Greed butts. Good for keeping away damage. We've got these little cats following us. I don't know where they're from. I'm not quite sure what they're about. Look at this with rubber cement. I love it. Are we ready to go? I think we are. Beautiful. We'll take the negative, obviously. Even more beautiful damage. Oh god, why did I try and move there? That was stupid. I hate this attack. I can't see what I'm doing. <laughs> it worked out though. Okay, this this was a run that went from me being pretty scared to do mother to I'm I'm pretty confident we're all good. I'm pretty confident we're all good. Ooh, is that a big a mini big chest that we got there? I mean we're we're very, very good now. Oh lord. We're very, very good now. The wafer literally just doubled our HP on these floors. We also seem to always have a Holy Mantle. Oh, uh, it's, it's from our Wooden Cross, isn't it? I was going to say, despite not having Holy Mantle, but it's because we've got Wooden Cross. I kind of forgot we had that. Yeah, we are destroying runes now. I, I I don't think I've ever had rubber cement with Furton before, but it's very good. Don't know why we have 42 range in that room, but there you go, we did. One of these glitch hearts. I don't think we need it, do we? No, we don't. Careful of these guys spewing out all sorts of stuff. Alright, come on, take us straight to the boss. You know you want to. I'm not even needing to use straw at the moment. I mean, this room I can straw it up a little bit. I've got to remember the water spouts as well are going to help out. I 
How is this not the way to the boss? How dare you, game? How dare you slander me? Gotta be up here then, hasn't it? I mean, that's a sun card. Why not just use that? The sun. It is indeed the right way. Ah! Oh, that guy fucking popped up from underneath me. How dare you? Nah, I'm, I'm good for the death deal, thank you. I'm very happy with my items. Good old rock gut. I don't think I've ever seen an attack that the first phase actually does. Good, there we go. Okay. Rock gut. Super easy. Pretty cool boss, but super easy. More fire rate. Got them. What, um, okay. Damage, lovely. Oh, dude, this, this is insane with, um... <laughs> this is absolutely insane. Okay, we could be here a little while. I'm not going to go down too far. Right, one more. Damn it, I was hoping for more black hearts, but still. Good damage. No, do you know what? I'm going to do, do two more. I was hoping for more black hearts. Okay, there you go. We're good. <laughs> We're good. Not knowing my health here isn't ideal. We upped our damage quite a bit there. Managed to get an air uh, devil's dagger as well, which is a pretty good item. Oh, you're moonwalking. Hopefully we can get a devil's dagger leveled up all the way before the boss fight. In fact, I probably won't even do the boss fight until I do get it leveled up all the way. One level, because it does make a good difference on your DPS. Ten burn orbitals, why not? Yeah, so we found this early, but we don't need it. We'll be heading back, thank you. I would like more red little crystals first, thanks. And potentially more HP as well, I did spend quite a bit that I really didn't need to, but... When I had the wafer, I was like, why not just go deep and try and get as much damage as I can out of this? Honestly, people people still think of um, Sanguine Bond as the item it was when um, Repentance first came out, which was trash. It's no longer trash, people. It's so goddamn good. It has had a glow up. And a pretty big one. Hey, there's another level up. I think it's one more level before Max on our daggers. See if I get anything worthwhile out of this. Probably not, but it's worth a try. But Penny. Good. Sharp Penny. Doesn't make much of a difference to us, thank you. What are you doing? I don't even know what you do. I can't figure that out. Just keep stomping through. Come on, we've got to be close. I'll try you again. You weren't very good last time to me. Again, not very good. Oh, I didn't realize you guys were in the corners here. Didn't get any more HP here. I don't think that's terrible. Health is still pretty decent for having the wafer. 
the hell's that? Uh... Ah, that's something to do with next floor. I don't want to bother with that. Don't want to bother messing around with that. Forgot about the red rooms. Oh, beautiful. One last chance at glory. And a soul heart to boot. I mean, this is pretty good. Okay, I thought these were three of hearts, so uh, three of diamonds isn't the best. Three of diamonds. I will take that. At least I will take that. Right. We are good to go. G -g -g good to go. G -g -g good to go. Secret room. Strength card here. I still think this is gonna be this is gonna be better. This spirit of clairvoyance. What does it do again? Grants an aura that slows the enemies and reflects projectiles for a hundred seconds. I think that's pretty good. A hundred seconds is like most of the fight. Thanks for that book activation on the uh Oh no, we got another book activation on the boss fight here, nice. Oh wait. This aura is very small. Okay, this isn't as good as I thought it was gonna be. I kind of thought the aura would be like, like, locational and I'd place it and it'd be fairly big. It's fucking teeny tiny. Ah, what the fuck? I got it launched there. Look at my daggers go. Oh no, I am, I am reflecting projectiles. It's okay. I am reflecting projectiles in a decently wide aura. Trying to use my active when I remember to as well. Because 10%, my damage against this guy is pretty goddamn good. Use my active a little early there. A lot of water spouts up here that I can take advantage of. There you go. Well then, that was a pretty fun run. Nice and easy breezy. I hope you guys enjoyed. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next one.